Hello YouTube world. I'm up on this roof. The client called me over here to look at a leak on a PVC pipe and I figured I'd create a little value for YouTube by showing you kind of what I do and what I'm looking at here. This particular house was impacted by by some hail. You can see that that it's a break in the vinyl siding that goes through all the way to the home wrap. There's another one up here. Again, a hail impact that has broken this vinyl siding. This is what hail looks like, and this is what it does to people's houses. You can see that totally dents up this vent. That's what it looks like. Some of the size of this hail is very large. This is a replacement roof. Someone had already replaced it at some point, and since then it's been impacted by hail. You can see that there are certain areas, like right there, where one impact hit both shingles. You can see there are two separate shingles here. So that's that's an area where a hailstone has impacted it. There's a bunch of them throughout this particular house. This one goes all the way down to the fiberglass threads. You know, in cases like these, if you don't address it, what can happen is the, the holes will wear out. Now this is a mechanical hole, but you can see that it's dilapidated all the way down to the fibers. This one goes all the way through. That's a mechanical damage. Maybe someone dropped a hammer or a ladder or something like that. But what happens is now that the granules aren't protecting the matting, it's going to deteriorate much more rapidly. So it's really important to get hail damages and things like that addressed right away before it gets any worse. And same thing with siding. I mean, you don't want to get water back behind here. In this case, and this house was sold recently, so whoever buys this house is going to get a house with hail damage, unfortunately. It is what it is. All right, YouTube. Take care. Be safe on these roofs.